company with strokes at the extreme level. Today I am going to introduce uh, my tool which is developed by myself and its name is USB Silent Copier. USB Silent Copier is an application which copies the user data silently. When you put a USB into the system, it will copy it automatically the USB and store it into the uh, system. The path specified uh, or otherwise it will copy itself to the uh, documents folder. You can see it has a page on GitHub and um, it has a quite uh, big description over here so I'm uh, gonna tell you um, how it works imagine this you are an engineering student and you want to have uh, as much um, precise information as possible about the next exam uh, but you um, where do you get this information? Simple, from your professor's mind. You are a parent and you want the, uh, you want to make sure your kid is not trying to hide illegal stuff from you. Where do you get this info? Simple again, from your kid's mind. Are you the kind of dude who want to uh, know every file that comes and goes from uh, from and to your PC where do you get this info oh, you guessed uh, from people's mind but what do I mean by that yet it's simple people use flash drives to store data that they can carry around for different purposes uh, in our uh, cases above your professor stores exams your kid stores stuff and people in general store the uh, store and transfer files and data so how can you get the access to information and make fact based information decisions so we are introducing usb silent copier the only software of your kind in the world usb silent copier is the only software solution for that matter usb silent copier copies all the data uh, from the USB flash drive connected to the your computer and puts the data into the folder uh, onto the computer so that you can access and browse it later. It literally gives you access to all the data of every USB flash that, that has been connected to your computer uh, without you having physical access to those, those flash drives but not only that select the USB you want to ignore, choose the uh, drive, USB silent copier, uh, all the content of the USBs. Backup all your USB drives without clicking any button. Just plug in your USB drive and you're done. Collect data from USB drives that people connect to your computer. It runs automatically at Windows Startup and detects USB drives instantly upon insertion. Time after uh, time, we improved, improved it and does not copy just documents but also pictures, audios, videos, and other stuff are, are all the content of all USB. It can copy all flash drives that can that are connected to your PC that way. Is um, PC that way installed it. It can copy all external hard drives. And you can select which USB you want to ignore. Previously, you do not wanna uh, wanna copy all your USBs. Obviously, choose the drive in, in which you want to s wanna save the clipboard contents. Should have all should have at least 30 GB of free space because some USBs are of 32 GB. So. You must have 30 GB free space in your C disk or the disk you select uh, to store the data in it. Mm, 
where no competition is a unique software. There is no competitor of our uh, software in the, in the world. It is the only software which uh, only we have, no one else. And we have developed it. We do not know of any other software that does this specifically as are better, but we think there are few hardware devices which cost thousands of dollars. So how how to install it? I'm gonna show you practically. So connect to me uh, on Fiverr, Facebook, or YouTube, and I will send you this. Uh, setup of the USB silent copier so I have uh, a lot of other softwares which I have developed but um, there is USB silent copier it's a C sharp application and here it is it's the 3.0 it's the 2.0 so I'm gonna show you the 3.0 first setup of USB sign up here. Copy it, paste it into the desktop. So double click on it and it will be installed automatically. You literally do not need any uh, need to connect on um, to click on the next 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 here it is it I took a break and now I am back and I have modified your source code a little bit and you can see your source code and uh, here Started in my PC, so it has copied it. It is installed and uh, copied the USB which was inserted in my PC. So here is the data. So you will see in here is a file just open it and you will see where your uh, where your data has been copied. So uh, my data is here USB data. The USB name, which is in the J C H U J J, and see here all of my files which are in my USB are also showing here. Uh, as you see, my USB has uh, the same files as these are, and. Uh, to be copied so see here mm. so this becomes a new USB and, and now I am uh, plugging out the USB now inserting again the USB and the USB is, is again started copying now if I if you uh, start the USB in uh, the same USB again uh, it will not be copied as you can see uh, I have plugged out the USB and now plugging in the USB because it's the same USB which was copied so it will not copy it again and 
and also you can uh, set up exceptions for the USB uh, for example uh, if you uh, want uh, your own USB to not be copied uh, you will uh, you will name your USB like uh, on your own name like extreme add now now go to here and here open this file and enter the usb name here and close this file so mm, now if i plug out the usb and plug in the usb again it will not be copied so as you can see uh, it has not copied it uh, this time so it's quite intelligent so there as you can see here my e two of my usb data is here one was my usb and the other is jesse h j j j So it was on, but if you want to uninstall this uh, software, you will have to uh, like insert a USB, and it will copying start copying it again, start copying it. So now you will have to click on here. And it will be uninstalled. Uh, extreme USB copier is uninstalled and it will not be uh, run on the next startup. Close and start again to install. So it has been uninstalled. If you want to see uh, description of the software here, you can see. And, uh, if you click here, uh, it will show you. It will take you to the GitHub page, and that's all. Thanks for watching the video, and I hope you like this software. Uh, if you want to get this software, please contact me on. Please contact me on my father. And uh, you can also contact me on my Facebook. I will I will put the uh, links in the description, and you can contact. Or you can uh, search this software on um, Google, and you will find this YouTube page. And here my links are given my email is also given you can also contact me on uh, this email my private profile and my messenger thanks for watching this video and uh, subscribe and like the video